Hi everyone, do you know what time it is? It's time for a giveaway. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome to my channel. To my viewers, my subscribers, thank you guys so much for taking a few minutes out of your day to spend with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart. If you are new to my channel, I hope that you would please hit that little red subscribe button before you go. I would love to have you join us for future videos. Your comments, of course, are always welcome. And I hope that you give this video a thumbs up. So today we are just doing our informal vlog, coffee, tea, wine, and life. And you're probably thinking, wow, Nancy, that's a funny looking glass of wine you got there. What the heck are you drinking now? I got iced coffee. I just needed a big glass to put it in so I could have lots of ice to kind of stir this around. So cheers, everyone. It's a perfect day for iced coffee. Cheers. So good. So you know, um, for the Christmas Vlogmas, I got from Carrig where I get my auto delivery for like regular flavored coffees, but they had a Christmas advent calendar for coffees. So it's a different coffee every day for the month of December. And this was one of them that was in there. So it was from the original donut shop, the Duo. So it's white chocolate and vanilla. And I liked it so much that I bought a box. And every now and then I'm just in the mood for it. So I made some today. I put it in the freezer, got it nice and cold. And then later just kind of added some ice, some more coffee creamer. Perfect, perfect ice coffee so good so anyway we have got our giveaway that we're doing today so today is saturday uh july 30th and we're doing the giveaway for the two happy planner memory books from the video that we did on the 14th for remembering rick and to me memories and holding on to memories are just so important and i just wanted to share that with you guys so i bought two of these happy planner books and these are not planners. These are actually ones that they make specifically for memory planning. They got, it's laid out by different dividers. So you can do different sections. There's different photos, um, pictures in here that you can just kind of add pictures, different size pictures. You can do some journaling. You can do recipes, whatever you want in here. They've all got like these dividers like a regular like a school notebook so if you wanted to separate and you wanted to have different children to have different section or your puppies or maybe different vacations that you've taken or different christmases uh family get-togethers to kind of keep things grouped together i also got two of these these are basically the same thing just to add on to your book i'm probably showing it backwards but it's pretty much the same thing Try to go like this where there's going to be the pictures in here, the pages in here to just kind of add your text and add some pictures. Just a lot of fun, I hope. So we have got two of those and we will pick two winners at the end of this. Uh, we had nine people that used the code word ENTOMY. I've already checked. Those nine people are already publicly suppressed, subscribed and they're in here. So looking forward to picking out two winners. Your chances, two out of nine. It's pretty good, right? Alrighty. So I got a giveaway from Alicia Martin and I love Alicia. And I, I know a lot of you that watch me watch Alicia too. I'll have her link below just in case you don't. Alicia, she's like kind of like my partner in this hashtag. Nancy and Alicia have no idea when it comes to skincare and makeup. Though she's a um, little bit more advanced than she lets on. But anyway, she does unboxings like clothing, lifestyle, beauty. She does cooking she's been doing getting into the decluttering and showing how she's just kind of spending a few minutes a day doing this maybe designating 10 minutes and you work on this and decluttering drawers and things that you don't use and so she's just really really wonderful very inspiring again i'll leave her link below she had a couple of giveaways going on i won one of them came in this box and i check everything out but i let's start Kind of go over real quick what she sent me. So first is this bag. It's a nice vinyl bag. It's purples and pinks and blues. Really pretty. And she had a couple of things in here. So we've got this Yves Saint Laurent. This perfume. Sample. 
Libre. We've got this liquid liner, eyeliner from Bella Pierre, and I am using a black liquid liner today, so I do, I don't always use liquid, but sometimes I just, I just grab for it. Uh, we got this Purity from Philosophy, so it's a one-step facial cleanser. I love, love using facial cleansers. I know I'm going to use that, because it just makes the size is perfect for like having a little hostess gift in your bathroom and we have guests come over so in case they forget something they they have some things to choose from but i know i'm going to use this oh and this is our hairdresser's invisible oil i love using oil in my hair from bumble and bumble and the last item in this little bag is Veruela. it's pure happiness it's support positive attitude support a positive attitude that sounds interesting all right so then there's a whole bunch of stuff outside the bag so we got this um rose i, I wanted to say rose because you know i'm in the mood for wine but i've got iced coffee so it's rose and charcoal infused a facial sponge so i'm sure that'll get used we've got this kate hudson Juice Beauty, and it's a mask. It's a rose powder mask that you mix and use on your face. Probably your neck, too. Um, it, if you have your phone on your desk at work a lot, or I suppose even if you're videoing, using your phone to video, this, to put your phone, put it on your desk. We've got some hand sanitizers, and I get sick every time. I go out of the house coconut and lemon i went out wednesday where i needed to make a quick trip to the grocery store i make a list a small list i just want to get in and out be and of course i by the time i leave my car to get into the grocery store get what i want stand in line and get out if i'm longer than 15 20 minutes i'm huffing i'm puffing i can't do it so i can only go in and get a few things at a time know exactly where i'm going don't look any around and so I'm in and out of that store in less than 15 minutes. And every time I go, I get sick. Yeah. So I was, I've been sick again this week. So hand sign sanitizer. Going to come in handy. So we've got this Perfect Repair shampoo and conditioner. That will get some use. I love trying out some different things. This one, Alicia, this one's going to scare the crap out of me because, you know, I still got that loofah that scared me and I threw it under the bed and it's still under the bed from like two years ago. So, oh, but this does have a nice name, Mimosas and Mandarin. It's a loofah soap. It's got this, at least this one is, is little, so yeah, I'm, I'm not sure about this. Things like that tend to scare me. Steve Laurent, now I think I've seen different people get different lipsticks and, and things from him but it's a total repair lip mask so that sounds good we've got looks like a foundation to try it's from Fenty Beauty it looks like a good color for me so I'm gonna enjoy trying that we've got living proof a defining gel for hair so try that we got Glam Glow. It's a clearing treatment, so a little mask maybe. So try that. We got these cute earrings from Tiger and Lily. The back even has like the tiger print. But it looks like little animal print in there. So those are going to be really cute to wear. We've got Jelly Bean Queen. We've got some bath salts. And I love using bath salts, bath bombs. We've got this, and it came in this little brown box from J&L. It's a face mask. And it looks like it comes in a little pot of, like you'd put maybe ice cream or takeout or plant. So it's natural ingredients comes with this little wooden spoon so cute to make your own little mud mask we got a bag that came with these hair treatments so I got a couple of these to use it came in a cute little bag like this 
I'm still going, but I think we're getting close to the end. So we got this Echo Tools or Eco Tools. So it's like this exfoliating cleaner and like one of those little clean that you'd use, you know, these sponges for body washes. So that looks nice. We've got Envol. Not exactly sure what Envol is, but it's a well-being tool and looks like maybe you get three months of support for that. We got some Alpha H Liquid Gold. Some kind of acid here, glycolic acid. So nice skin care right here. So I love getting skin care. I'm going to enjoy that. I think we're almost at the end. I think I got two things to go. So this is um, Zion Health Adama. It's a glacial mud mask. And I have still been masking every day. So alternating between different mud mask and peel off mask and the sheet mask. I am enjoying it. So some more masking to do. And this Redken. It's a dry shampoo powder. So I've never seen this before, but you know, hashtag Nancy has no idea. So it's a dry powder in here. So I will have to read up on that, but okay. But that looks easy enough. So thank you so much, Alicia. There's so many wonderful things in there, some new products for me to try. I am going to enjoy using it. So thank you guys. Thank you, Alicia, so much. Again, I will have Alicia check uh, listed below. So you can just kind of click on that. Go check her out if you haven't. And probably most of you are already subscribed to her. She is really, really a sweet lady. Oh, so what else did I want to say? So I think like two weeks ago, I got some things in and I still have not finished them. So I still have my color pop to do. Um, and I've got some eyeshadow palettes in there and I know some of them are going to be a giveaway. I got like, um, an eyeshadow palette and I think both Ipsy this month and BoxyCharm. Haven't swatched them. It's been hard because I'll probably end up giving one of the way and trying to decide which ones I'm going to keep and which ones I'm going to give away. So I need to get that one done soon. I got some more goodies in from Shane. Oh my gosh, they're still in the bag. I'm dying to show them to you. I should have grabbed them to try to do during this vlog. So maybe I'll try to do that next week. And um, what else did I get? I got my yoga club in. I got another face story that I didn't open yet. And Sip and Savor. It's another wine club that I'm in. So that comes out every two months. So I forgot exactly when, but it came in a while ago. And yeah, I didn't open it yet. So yeah, I could still got some things to do. But Anyway, I have, you know, when I got this idea to do the giveaways for the, um, the memory book, I bought myself a new planner and I really wanted to get back into using my planner and I buried it under Alicia's things here. So I got an 18 month planner and this one's, uh, bigger than the Erin Condren ones that I'm used to using. So this one is the big planner. This one covers 18 months. So it started in June, the end of June, the last week of June to go coincide with the first week in August. I really want, yeah, first week in June. Yeah, I'm getting tired. Can you tell? I'm starting to lose my voice too. But um, yeah, so I really wanted to get back into using my planner and just having fun with my planner, adding pictures, um, keeping track when I'm able to exercise again. I did actually use my under desk elliptical two times last week. Probably explains why I was so tired, but I'm trying. So anyway, I'm going to show you just just real quick the three pages that I did the three spreads spreads that I did so this one is from uh, June 27th is the first day that this started and it went through July 30th July 3rd my camera froze and then it just came back on so this is the first one that I did I just did three weeks here so this is from June 27th and it goes through Sunday July 3rd and this was actually Raina's birthday week on the 29th so i've got her family picture in here and then a little thing for her birthday right here 
And then the next was for July 4th. Really need more room back here. So this was July 4th week. And just some different things, different stickers that I used, different things that whether I did some things in YouTube, what hours did I work, things like that. Later on, once I get exercising again, I will have a space to keep track of my steps and things like that. And then this was the week of the July 13th. So I've got Rick's anniversary in here. So those are the three I did. And I really want to get back into doing that. So I'm excited to finally set aside a day to kind of work on that. Excited about that. And oh my gosh, I am almost finished with Darling Girl. I have got like 80 pages to go. It's not like the Hacienda at all. It's not scary like that, but it's just a, it's a different take on Peter Pan and the descendants of, of Wendy, like Wendy was the grandmother. And so Holly is her granddaughter and her great granddaughter. And she's missing. The granddaughter's missing. She's been in a coma for almost a year and someone takes her body. They think it's Peter Pan. Tinkerbell is helping them. She enlists the aid because she doesn't want to go to the police and say, yeah, the father's Peter Pan because who's going to believe her, right? And uh, my child's in a coma and yeah, I kept her locked away. I didn't have her in a hospital. I kept her in a place and I paid for private nurses. So she just doesn't want to do that. So she enlists the aid of a private detective. His name is Christopher Cook. And guess what? He's got a prosthetic hand. One of them is a hook. I kid you not. But anyway, it's more exciting than you would think. It doesn't really get into like the fairy tale aspect of it. It references that and it's the family of the children in the nursery that had the Peter Pan adventure. So it's kind of goes back and forth and how people, yeah, it's, it's good. It's really good. I got like 80 pages to go. I'm so excited. Don't know what I'm going to read next, but it, this book is better than I really thought it was going to be. It's just really, really fun. So it's uh, like Darling Girl brings all the magic of the classic Peter Pan story to the present while also exploring the dark underpinnings of fairy tales, grief, aging, sacrifice, motherhood, and just how far we will go to protect those that we love. So it's really, really good. So anyway, before I run out of breath, we're going to kind of, I'm just going to take a break. I'm going to have a sip of coffee, get kind of, get my breathing under control. And then we're going to pick two winners. Alrighty. So I'm back. Sorry about that. Had some iced coffee, got my breathing under control. I'm good as new. So anyway, we had nine people that entered going to pick two names. So can we have a drum roll, please? All right. So let's kind of, kind of quick shuffle these names. And, and we got one right here. So let's, I, I have no idea why I do everything upside down. So we have reviews with Sue. So Sue, you are the first winner of the memory book. And I know she gets a uh, subscription to like a junk journaling. So maybe some of those things that she gets in there, like the washi and things like that will be good to that. So anyway, we're ready for the next one. Ready? Alrighty. Drum roll, please. Alrighty. And we've got another one here. So and we have Gail. McGaffey. So Gail, she's been, she supports so many of us. She's a lovely, lovely lady. She even sent me her picture that I got to use in, in, for my vlogmas that I wanted to kind of give a thank you and play like old Lang Zang Zine. How would you say that? And actually sent me one of her pictures. So that was really cool. So anyway, Gail reviews with Sue. Just let me know that you're seeing this. You know, I don't like to put a time frame on your getting back in touch with me because I'm always so far behind. I hate to kind of put that pressure on someone. Just let me know that you got it. I think Sue probably has her mailing address. Um, 
on her YouTube channel, and I know I've got Gail. So anyway, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you congratulate our winners, and um, yeah, let me know what you think. If you do like um, the idea of using like planners for like journaling and keeping track of schedules, because maybe towards the end of the year, um, maybe I will get another one and do like a giveaway of something like that if you're interested. So. Anyway, thanks so much for taking time out of your day to spend with me. It really does mean a lot to me. Take care, everyone. Stay safe. Be kind. Be happy. Enjoy life. Love you guys so much. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.